Okay, maybe you've had the same problem. I've got some meshes. They're attached to some bones, some armature. Um, and uh, and this, these meshes are posed. And I need to edit some of the vertices of one of these objects so that it looks right when it's posed in this position. Um, and I'm going to do it with blend shapes uh, because I want it to have this position sometimes and sometimes fit into his hand just right. So um, I'm going to duplicate this object. So I've got this object. I'm going to press Shift E and Enter right away. That keeps it in the same position. Now um, to edit this, you can see I, my duplication is right here. And um, to edit this, I'm going to press Tab. Normally that would send him somewhere else over here wherever I created this thing that's not helpful because I need to it needs to look right for the uh, in the hand another thing is if you've already got some shape keys be on that basis shape key the first one that's just how it's got to be um, to edit this so pressing tab to go into edit mode sends it somewhere else that's not good I'm gonna turn up visibility for the original one I want it to be right over on top of the hand in order to work with it. Go over to your modifiers, and if the armature is on, press these two, edit mode and on cage. And then when you press tab, it's there. And you can make whatever edits you want. I'm going to um, kind of grab these guys and move them over this way. Proportional editing, hopefully you understand that a little bit. Uh, okay, so let's say I like that. Um, press tab. I'm going to turn the visibility on of the original. It's behind it. You can see it. Now, if I were to do a normal shape key here, I'm going to have the edited one highlighted. I'm going to press shift and hold and click on the other one. And then I go over here and do join as shapes. Great. Except for some reason it moves it all, you know, something to do with the bones. It moves it out of the way. I don't want that. So, I'm going to click on the edited one and go back to the mo the armature and delete it. Remove that modifier. Now he's back over there. Now press shift and click on the original one. Go to the ver the object data properties and do join as shapes. And that should work just fine. Let's see if it does. Yep, that's good. So we did it, and that's how you do it. You're welcome.